Hi guys, Archie Luxury, Archie Luxury Channel. We're doing a paid review. This is for Mark. This is for Mark. And uh, Mark is saying here, Hi Arch, I made you a payment. Um, I know you're very busy. I took your advice and sold my 2015 Omega Speedmaster Snoopy and made a mint. Here is my collection. I want to add, what do you think? 2003 Omega Speedmaster Professional with Moonface. 2003 Speedmaster Snoopy. Well, he sold that. 1989 Rolex GMT2 16710 Coke. And a Breguet Type 20 Transatlantic on a Breguet black leather strap. I'm thinking of adding a Batman. Na, 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 na. Batman. But should I get a Reverso instead? I like a beefy watch and not something that is delicate. Anything, any benefit to getting a Patek? Will the Batman hold its value? Cheers, Mark. Yes, Mark. Yes, Mark, indeed. Thank you so much for the uh, email. The paid review. Uh, Marky, 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 Marky. I would say to you, uh, Batman, anything Rolex has gone crazy. They've gone really, really crazy. Crazy, crazy. Crazy, crazy. Uh, Batman, will it hold its value? Look, it's it's very hard. It's very hard to crystal ball gauge. I think you should buy watches you like. Not necessarily what are great investments. But Batman, any of the Rolex Steel Sports, very, very hot at the moment. So that's a good thing. The benefits to getting a paddock. Well, the thing is, paddock dress watches are a little soft in the secondary market. So you may be able to... Get something way above your weight. Punching way above your weight. That's like going out with the really sexy girl uh, when you know she's out of your league. That's what it is. You're punching way above your weight. So you may be able to do that on a paddock Calatrava. Uh, you've got a nice, nice, nice base there. I tell you what, the Omega Speedmaster Professional. Uh, I'm not a huge fan of the Moon Phase one, but hey... Love the Coke, 1989 Coke. Ooh, fuck. That is a beautiful piece to have. Don't sell your Coke. Uh, I think Cokes are getting more valuable than Pepsis. They're very, very in demand there. I was talking to a, a super collector today. The Coke is getting fucking out of hand, man. They are, they are absolutely amazing. Absolutely amazing. Amazing. The Cokes are not are very, very crazy critters. Um, I think the Batman, man, it's just such a cool thing. You've already got a vintage. Um, I think it'd be lovely to have another modern GMT interpretation. The Batman's a great watch. If you've made a lot on the Snoopy, get the Batman, man. You can't go wrong because it's it's cashable. You can always get rid of it. They're all, they're very, very wanted. So, personally, my advice to you, grab it. Grab it whilst you can. Uh, look, the Reversos, you may get a great deal. Reversos are fairly soft. Jager Lucultra at the moment is a bit of a soft brand. Uh, they are, they are a bit soft. Yes, they are, sir. They are soft. Soft, soft, fuckeroonies. They are soft. Why are they soft? Well, the Rolex market is very... The whole Rolex... The whole market is Rolex! That's what it is. It's just gone crazy. Um, I, I would say to you, in all honesty, Rolex is your better thing to buy uh, because it's going... They're very... It's a very, very much a demand for Rolex, man. They're so cool. So, so cool. Rolex is cool. Um, I, I think you've got some really cool shit there you got some you got your shit together i love the fact you got a breguet i mean i i love i love the breguets man the bregs the breguets you know breguets kind of like jager le culture weight punches way above its weight uh they're a they're a great thing i love the bregsters i really do love the bregsters you got a lot of class there what would i get what would i get fuck uh, fuck, fuck. What would I get? Oh, if you could swing a Calatrava, man, that'd be cool. That'd be fucking cool. Let me say that much. 
Yeah, that'd be very cool. They're a little bit, probably a little bit out of reach. But the Batman is a safe bet. You're going to enjoy it. You can wear it. You'll always get your money back. That's probably what I'd do. Batman! Batman! Na 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 Batman! Batman. So, uh, will it hold its value? Hey, there is no fucking guarantees on the Archie Luxury channel, but quite possibly it can. The, the, the prediction is the Rolex market is going to get, prices are going to go up more. They're not going down, fuckeroonies. So, uh, yeah, I'd probably get into the Batman. That's a safe bet there. Um... Safest bet, safest houses, can't go wrong with a Batman. Batman! That's what I reckon I'd be doing, the Batman, fuckers. Batman. Uh, good collection, I like the way you got some style and class. Um, I mean, I, I love, I love my Jager Lucutra. JJ Lucut! I love Jager Lucutra. Fantastic brand, I love the brand to death. Quality, quality. And uh, I, I love it. That's one of my all-time favorites. So, man, I'm in for the watches, not just for the money. It's for my, my passion. It's not about the money. It's about the passion, fuckers. Passion pop. It's passion pop. So, um, yeah, you got to have fun with your watches. Great to see you uh, having fun, loving the brands, having a great time. I'm Archie Luxury. Quick whist watch check, fuckers. I'm a purist. I wear a zenith, fuckers. I am a purist. There you go, fuckers. Tell me what you fuckers like, subscribe, tell your fuckhead, fuckhead friends, and don't forget, put a few really nasty comments down below. Fuckeroonies, fuckeroonies. Here are six watches I've been offered. They offered to put my name on the dial. They offered to make it exclusive to the Archie Luxury channel. They'd do anything to climb into bed with me. And I said no. That's right. I said no. Oh, and don't forget, fuckeroonies, like, subscribe, and tell your fuckhead friends. And don't forget to mention the Archie Luxury travel channel. That's where I'm doing live shows, fuckers. <laughs>